if you look at supply chains over the last two or three decades, everybody's accepted a little bit of inefficiency or slop. Hmm. They've affected you know, some level of defects. And that's because that you, you practically couldn't throw people at these problems in an efficient way. You know, getting an address wrong happens. Getting a delivery wrong happens. And you can't really prevent that without a new construct. I think AI is that new construct. And as you see agentic AI and physical AI evolving, I think a lot of what both businesses expect and what consumers expect of what the bar is for what their physical experience of supply chains are being, I think that's going to ratchet up. And I think that, again, both represents an opportunity for companies to invest early in it. And as thinking about how to build the right amount of integration of these products to make these experiences uh, more defect-free, more efficient. Are you already starting to see that happen at Amazon we today? Are, we're, seeing, uh, we're seeing it happening all across operations. I don't think there's one operations team today that does not have at least some work going on AI and several that have had success stories already. You know, one of the early investments we made was in an area where you know, we see probably the most contribution of delivery defects where customers don't get their package on time or they may not get it at all. And that's in our sort of mapping and geospatial system. So these are the systems that try to represent the physical world. They can tell you exactly where you know a customer's home is, whether they like their delivery on the front door or the side door, whether to leave it with the receptionist downstairs. We found that using Agentic AI and combining sort of the world data that's available with the Amazon data allowed us to very rapidly close a number of gaps that for years didn't feel like we we had a path to close. Well, has it brought down the defect rate? It has. By it how has. much? Um, I don't have a precise number to share, but you know, significant double-digit percentages. Really? And so do you believe you could be in an era of zero defects on, on account of agentic AI? I don't know about zero defects, but I think defects can become far more of an exception than the norm.